single thing you see here tonight was planned and executed by this group of students. Okay, let's go. A lot is happening at the moment. <laughs> Designing the decor and figuring out all the centerpieces. The whole show has always been a lot of moving parts. It, you learn a lot from it when, when it comes to teamwork and things like that, working with the team and then having to put that, you know, into kind of real time. Yes, absolutely. I think it's a good experience for the workplace because we've kind of just thrown everything. They were like, just do it, but they didn't really tell us how, so we kind of had to figure it out from there. So we are sold out, but you know, trying to get everybody at the late arrivals, they can go wherever fits. Yeah. I think it's worth a risk. What do you think? It's going to be amazing. So I'm, I'm very excited to see what, what it's going to end up turning out like. Definitely a lot of people, which I'm excited. Calm before the storm, yeah. We're all ready back here. We got our first outfits on, so I think we're all really excited to get the show started, for sure. Good evening, everyone, um, and welcome to this year's Color Me Kentucky Fashion Show at the University of Kentucky. Please join us in welcoming our honorary guest of the evening and our master of ceremony, Carson Kressley. This is so great. We want to say a few words before we start. And we have amazing, amazing clothes for you to see. All of this entire show was put together by students here at the University of Kentucky. It's incredible. They did all of this. They're modeling. They secured the looks. I have a hefty job over here. I am the runway coordinator. So I'm telling all the models to go when they need to go and make sure they remember to pose at each spot. We're about to go on. Okay, let's hit it. Definitely shoulders back for sure. Pivot turns follow with your feet, and we really like to emphasize to smile, because, you know, it's not New York Fashion Week or anything. They're real life students, so they're not angry like the ones in New York. If you look at least like you know what you're doing, then everyone else is gonna think that you know what you're doing too. So we got people that have walked before, we've had people that have never walked before, but everyone looks really, really good. We really had to focus on, you know, what is Kentucky? You know, what, what are we known for? Streetswear and homecoming dresses and Keeneland outfits. So we got the whole spectrum light out tonight. Lexington's the new Europe. It's very, it's very fashionable. We're all seniors, so I think it's just a great way to end our careers sort of at UK, and it's just been really special to be a part of it, especially with Elizabeth and Carson. Truly, the networking has been unbeatable. I could not imagine being given the opportunity to network at any other place like I have here. It's been really fun, especially working with the models has been a really cool experience. Really because of the supporters that are here tonight, these experiences is, are possible. Carson, you are an inspiration to so many, and I am, for one, never gonna forget this night. Thank you so much for lending us your talents. Fashion is important. And of course, nonstop laughs. Look around. If it weren't for fashion, we'd all be nude right now. And how scary would that be? Elizabeth Goff, since meeting Elizabeth last year, I knew she was someone special and a true champion of individuality. It's an understatement to say her kindness, generosity, and enthusiasm for our students knows no bounds. She has been an invaluable part of tonight's event and in galvanizing support for our program. Her passion is truly contagious. And I've had a great time working with the university. So I want to thank you all for coming and supporting this event. It, every dollar goes to students. So thank you all very much.
shared with you our fashion story, and we encourage you to leave tonight inspired to live your own story.